Good morning! So it's a little over a week later that I vlogged. Today is December 1st. Happy Vlogmas! So I'm not partaking in Vlogmas. Like I don't know if I can do 25 days straight. I'm just going to be honest with you guys. I almost did it the year before last year. But it's just so hard. But I am going to vlog as much as possible. So please keep tuning into my videos and showing me love. And um, this morning, I'm going to the dollar store and the grocery store. I'm going to the dollar store because I need to top up on some household items. And I need to get some cleaning items for my cleaning business. And then also my little cousin turned eight years old a few weeks ago and I'm gonna be seeing him tonight so I need to get him a little birthday gift so yeah and then later tonight I'm going to my grandmother's with all my cousins and their kids and I think I'm gonna get some snacks to take as well just so we have stuff to snack on because now that I'm older I feel so bad eating my grandmother's food because I know that she only buys stuff for herself and I don't want to eat up all her snacks you know so I'm gonna get some treats and yeah I'm, I'm gonna take you guys with me it's 10 30 in the morning I should be back home by 12 I decided to take the day off and I'm actually gonna work tomorrow instead so that's what I love about working for myself and I'm really hoping that in the future in the near future I can become a full-time youtuber because work for yourself yeah you can also work for yourself being a full-time youtuber and you have your freedom <sighs> that's my dream <laughs> anyways i'm talking too much um i didn't even eat breakfast so i'm hoping i can hold off until i come back home because i don't feel like buying extra food that's why i need to go to the grocery store because i've been eating out too much oh yes I didn't make a list I didn't make a I usually make a list but I today I just made a mental list and I just remembered I need to get some fruit cups so I'll get those when I go to the superstore so stay tuned I'll take you guys with me so I'm in the dollar store I'll show you guys what I got because when I go home because it's kind of busy let me show you guys what I came across how cool Okay, so the dollar store was hectic. And there's not, there's black people here where I live, but it's not like as common. And um, the town I live in is still becoming more diverse. A lady parked right beside me. Yeah, so it's becoming more diverse, and now there's a black guy who works at the dollar store, which is great. Love that. But when I went to his register, he didn't even say hi. He, he, he literally didn't speak. And then I put condoms on the counter. <laughs> and he... You should have seen the way he, he looks so uncomfortable. Like, bro, they're condoms. Relax. Like, and then after he rung up all my stuff, he literally, like, stepped away from the register and, like, looked out the window. Like, what the fuck? Anyways, I'm here at the Superstore, and I'm going to go in here. It looks a little busy, so I might bring you guys in. Well, I might show you guys around. I'm not sure yet. We'll see. Okay, so I'm back home now, finally, after two hours. I can't believe I was out that long. Um, 
I'm gonna show you guys what I got. So we're gonna start off with the dollar store. Actually, no, I'll start off with the Guardian because I went to the Guardian first, dollar store, and then Superstore. It was $7.99. No man, I only pay $3.99 or $4.99 for it. There was one time where I did come across it and it was $2.99, but whatever, that's besides the point. So the past few times I went to the Guardian, I've been wanting to get this because I used to always get it at Giant Tiger, but they discontinued it. I don't understand. So I said, let me go get it today because I've been wanting it for so long. Oh my God, it smells amazing. So this is lav this is the Snuggle brand. These are scent boost these are laundry scent boosters and it's in the lavender blossom scent. I don't normally like lavender, but this is like a sweet it smells like candy and it smells so good in your laundry. So I was thinking to add this in the lavender pine cell in my laundry, and that is gonna be a really good combo i told you guys i had to get my cousin a birthday gift so that's what i got oh i actually got a robux i actually got a roblox gift card to give to my cousin from from the guardian but i left it i accidentally left it in the car so i'm gonna go get it once i put these bags back in the car i needed more sponges to do my dishes with I like to do my dishes with these and I like to clean with these. Like if I clean with them, they're going right in the garbage. But if I'm doing my dishes, I'll keep them for a few days and then I'll change them out. I got a mop head. I'm going to my grandmother's tonight and I told you guys I wanted to bring like some snacks. So I'm bringing some Pringles. I, I'm i gonna bring some peach rings. I was gonna keep them for myself, but I'll bring them to my grandmother's tonight. I finally hit the bottom of my pepper container. So I just threw that out last night because I used all of it. So I had to, I had to pick up a new one. I picked up some Cheeto puffs for when I come back home tonight. Some of these up, I'm not sure if they even work, <laughs> but it's better to just keep these on hand. It's better to just keep these on hand. You get three for $2. Never tried these ones before, but I'm just gonna keep them in my drawer because, yeah. Because if the, <laughs> the person who I'm talking to if they forget to bring them, then I'll be set. I picked up another mop head for backup. I picked up a lint roller for my client's house because she has pets. And this is really good for furniture. I have one more eyebrow pencil left. I had to go stock up. These are the only eyebrow pencils I'll use. And like the past three months, maybe two, maybe two months the past two months when i was at the dollar store i was always eyeing these and welch's are one of my favorite candies but they came out with the um what are they called they came out with the juice filled ones and i've been scared to try them because i know i like the original but i don't know if i like the stuff in the inside but my twin sister, she told me I need to I need to try them. So I picked them up and I have to take to my grandmother's. I'm gonna bring some popcorn because there's gonna be a lot of us there. People can just share it, you know? So then I got my cousin his little gift. So I'll show you what I got because I'm literally gonna see him tonight and the video's going up tonight, so it doesn't matter. I got this bag to put the stuff in. So I got him Doritos. I got Kit Kat bars because kids love Kit Kat. There was a bunch of different chocolate to choose from, but I said, 
everybody loves Kit Kat, especially kids. So, and he can share them with his sister. He loves these push pops, so I got him a push pop. And kids love gummy worms. I was gonna get gummy bears, but I said, no, let me just get the gummy worms. Cause kids love gummy worms. What kid doesn't? And then, like I said, I got him the $25 Robux, Roblox gift card. So I got him the $25 gift card plus all this candy and stuff. And then, I was going through the game aisle because I was like, let me see what I could get him. I was going to get him my Uno card game. I totally forgot because I was so distracted. So I did come across this cool game. So this is, this is called Five Second Rule. Just spit it out. I've never heard of this, but I looked at the back and it looks so fun. For instance, name three breakfast foods. So you literally think, oh, this is easy. I can name three breakfast foods in five seconds, but when the pressure's on you and everybody's looking at you waiting to get flustered, time is not on your side and you have to say what comes to mind and risk ridiculous answers slipping out. It's, hilar it's a hilariously good time for parties and gatherings. It does say 10 to ages 10 to adult. He's eight. He's really smart. Like, he's, re he's very mature for his age. I think he'd like this. I got my favorite juice because I have been drinking water, but water be so boring, so I needed to switch it up. And then tomorrow, I'm planning on making... That's a tongue twister. Squash soup. <laughs> When I seen this in the store, I said I have to have it. So I'm literally snacking on this once I'm off of here. I also picked up these noodles. These are my favorite brand of noodles right now. And I totally forget about the barbecue chicken flavor. These hit. They're so much better than the original chicken. So I like to bring these to my clients' house for lunch because it's like really quick. And then it's also filling. I ran out of butter and I've been waiting on I've been waiting for it to go on sale. This was on for such a great price. And um Imperial is one of my favorites in base cell. You know I had to get my fruit cups. These are my favorite, the fruit salad. Mm. I love taking these um to snack on when I'm working. So I got this pack of blueberries. These were on for a great price as well. They were nor they were originally $3.49 on sale for $1.99. So then I said I have to get some mangoes for my smoothies. And I have to get some strawberries. And I don't want to pick up food. I don't want to pick up takeout or anything tonight because I ate Burger King last night. So I said, let me take this to my mom so I can eat it there. But yeah, I'm not going to my grandmother's until 8 o'clock tonight. And I cannot wait until 8 o'clock to eat. So when I go to her house at 6, 6.30, I'll eat it there. So I was looking through like the healthy food aisle. And I came across this brand of chips. Um, It's called Terra. And literally, these are made from sweet potatoes and regular potatoes so i got another pack of fruit cups and i picked up watermelon um should i should i take this to my mom's or should i eat it for myself i picked up a chicken caesar salad then i also got my favorite dressings to put on it i picked up a bunch of bananas i picked up this hand soap it's not normally on sale, but it was today. I've been seeing people put flax seeds in their food, and it's really good for your gut. Oh, one last thing I forgot to show you. I got a bunch of clementines. My favorite. 
Okay, so I just pulled into my mom's and I can't stay for long because I have to be at my grandmother's for 7.30. Just one second. You must be tired from working. I didn't really want to be at work today. But... Well, at least it's Friday. Yeah. So I just got home from my grandmother's. I didn't vlog there because because a lot of people don't know that I vlog. And I don't want to, I'm not comfortable with telling them right now until I get like a thousand plus subscribers because they'll be... <sighs> They'll probably think I'm weird. I don't know. Um, and then also, when you tell people, oh, I have a YouTube channel, they literally go on their phones and watch the video while you're in the room. Like, that is so cringe. I hate when people do that. That's why I wish I didn't tell my friends and family that I, well, some other family members. I wish I didn't tell people that I had a channel. Let me show you guys what she got me. And I hope it turns out. So I already opened it when I was there. Such a pretty card. I'm not gonna read everything you guys can read yourself. You can read it and pause the video. And I always have my hair in a bun. I wish my bum was this big thing. I thought it was really pretty and the quotes really resonate with me. My clients are going to be like, where'd you get that? <laughs> so yeah, it's a really good size too. So that is it for Vlogmas day one. I can't believe the day's over. So stay tuned for tomorrow's vlog and I really hope my soup comes out. <laughs> I wanna put it in the crock pot, but the crock pot takes so long to start up. So I'm like, should I make it in the pot on the stove? I'm not sure. I'll see you about that when the time comes. So have a good night and I'll catch you guys tomorrow.